Hey, and so today, welcome back to Channel C for I guess my name is Bruce. If you haven't done so already and you're new here, please hit that like and subscribe and the bell notification and you'll be notified for any new videos that gets posted on this channel. And please let me know what you think of this mic. This is brand new and if I will stop tapping it and I apologise. Um, and I'm going to do a video today of how to multi-stream on OBS streaming software and this is, bear with me, I'm on the other screen. OBS. And if you don't know about OBS, it's a broadcasting studio that is free for Mac and open source, and you can use it on different platforms, Linux, Windows, so forth. So let's pull this back into this side. You will need a couple of tools. What we're doing is, and the reason why I have left the security and privacy up is um, the MacBook blocks, because it's an unknown trusted what not. So, I'm going to close that first, but where you will need to go is, I may have, let's have a look. I seem to have closed the page down, so let's now get it back. Just like that, we're back. So it's on the obsproject.com website. You multiple our uh, RTMP outputs plugin, and just click go to download, and it'll take you to GitHub. Now on Macs, I need the PKG one. Now on Windows, you can use a set of exe or zip. So we go, we click that there. It comes to a downloads folder. I'm just going to pop that to desktop for today's video. Hit replace because I've already got it. that down and I have OBS multi down here give it an open it will say it cannot be opened but we will bypass that by opening the settings tab click on security and privacy and we need to hit ok on this it will then jump up hit ok and open anyway done it will then open Let's pull back over because I'm multi screening. And now we can just close the settings tab, we don't need it anymore. Hey guys, Bruce is from the future here. Um, I realised I had to shut down the stream and reopen it so I could therefore install the. A few moments later. Display capture back on to the MacBook. And I know you'll have it multiple there, but I do apologise, it's the only way to see it. You will see up here multiple new target, add new target, my apologies, and it's got multiple output at the side. Click on this one. So RMTP server. Now this RMTP server and key is for your Twitch or your Facebook or whichever you're going to be using. And it's you just copy and paste that in here. And as soon as you start a stream, it'll automatically do that. You can do more targets as much as you need. So you can do Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, at the same time with only one stream so my advice get a moderator on each platform so you can see the chat they can send the chat back to you and then they can pop it on the screen so you can therefore answer questions directly from the video when your moderators pop them up on the screen down the bottom but that is a nice and quick video of how to download and install the multiple output filter well i'm going to pop that back over here so it takes away Down, pop you out the Dell, pop back over here, and it will stop doing so. So that is the way to get the multiple output stream on your OBS. And again, PKG for MacBook and other Mac devices, and EXE and ZIP of these ones. Again, this is the, the most recent, blah, blah, blah. it is Friday the 15th of July and this is the most recent copy I could find, but it still works really well and I'm going to do a video, my next live will be on, I believe, Facebook and maybe Instagram and YouTube at the same time, so we'll see how that goes, but that is how to install the multi 
stream tool on OBS on a MacBook. Now this is the MacBook M1. But again, thanks again for watching. This is another, I'm going to say random tech tip because I came across this by accident. So thank you very much.